so guys today is april 8th in america there's going to be an eclipse it's going to be happening today so eclipse happening today will be visible in major cities across texas including dallas fort worth austin and waco um so a solar eclipse occurs when the moon passes between the earth and the sun completely blocking the face of sun of course it's a big deal for us it will be the most watched eclipse in history due to the many large cities it will pass through and will be the last total solar eclipse across the united states for the next 20 years so that's why i say it's going to be a big deal for us for living in america <laughs> So I will not be watching from home. I'll be going to the viewing center to join my group to watch the eclipse. And uh, follow me. Let's go together. Okay. All right, guys. We are here. Today is 8th April in America. There's going to be a solar eclipse happening today. So I am at the viewing site. Everyone is going to gather here today. I'm going to be joining this viewing center to see and watch out for the eggs happening. So I, as you can see, music is on. Everyone is here. I'm going to join some group and wait for it to happen. All right. Yes, it's happening live. Solar eclipse on 8th April in United States of America. This is my first time of seeing this. Though my husband said it happened 20 years ago in Nigeria, but I never witnessed any, something of this sort before. So it's going to be my first time and I'm so excited. I'm going to see it live and direct. Don't go, don't move. And we're gonna view that together. Okay, let's see the binoculars that we are going to use for this. Ready, ready, ready. I got my viewing glasses. Yeah. Check those glasses off before you do that. So guys, um, I look at the sun. Uh, right now, we still have partial covering, partial covering of the sun. Yeah, it's coming up. It's not yet total. It's still a uh, part of the sun has been covered for now, and I'll still be looking and keep you updated. Thank you. The weather is beginning to change. I viewed the sun a few minutes ago. It's almost getting completely close. All right, let's get back to you. Get your loved ones close. All right. We don't know how dark the clips will be. All right. Less than about eight minutes.
still going on? He's still going on? He's meaning like 3% of the sun to be covered. I think it's gonna go dark. Ooh! Hey! It's covered! Alright, the estimated next total eclipse is about 139. It's about six minutes right here for Alex. 139. Make sure you're close to your loved ones. Make sure you got your glasses ready too. Guys, just look at this. This is pure epic. It's so beautiful. Oh my god, I Thank you for staying with me and watching this with me. But when we see cool things like eclipse, it can make us think about how amazing nature is and maybe make us feel closer to something bigger than ourselves. Some people think these events are messages from God showing his great powers among men. Well, in the Bible and um, book of Job, it talked about sun going dark and the moon looking red before something big happened. But we sh should remember that everyone might see this event differently mm -hmm, based on our beliefs. Instead of telling people what to think, it's better to talk about what these things mean to us personally and also listen to what others think too about that. That way we can all learn from each other and maybe grow closer to our faith through that. Thank you so much for watching. Watch out for our next delicacy, cat fish pepper soup. Please stay healthy and eat healthy. Thank you.